Watch plugin on Mirienda YouTube channel. There you go. So watch plugin. This is my new robotic news uh, program that I'm going to be doing. So first news item is ILIC. I ordered this on Kickstarter. Uh, if you're not familiar with ILIC, I actually got two of them. You can see you can here two together an to example a magic moment. Okay. from Energizer Labs. So there we go. Uh, we don't want to see any violence. No violence. So I am in the U.S., so it should have shipped on July 8th um, per their update. Uh, they've been pretty good with updates on the Kickstarter. Um, this is Kickstarter. If you got it on Indiegogo, it's a different uh, timeline. I think it's in August, maybe. Um, I just don't know. I, didn't, I ordered on Kickstarter. So uh, 30 to 35 days, we should be approaching that timeline soon. And so that means I should be getting my Ilex uh, pretty, uh, you know, maybe in the next week or two. I haven't gotten any uh, tracking number yet, though. So next is Robot Creator DX. I've done some videos on this. There are 15 days to go. This is, hey, Google, what's today's date? It's Sunday, July 31st, 2022. So July 31st, uh, 2022. Uh, probably this news will be uh, posted either tonight or, or tomorrow on August 1st. So 15 days to go. Here is my Robot Creator DX, the one that I put together, uh, Bluey. Uh, no talking right now because I wanted to be able to say the news. And this is my Hypercube. Jibo looks really good in the hypercube. Mm -hmm. Hello, Danielle. Hello. That's my real name is Danielle. Miranda's the channel, the online persona. So there's Robot Creator DX. So to understand what Jibo did earlier, uh, he's using QR Commander. Um, you can generate QR codes. Um, I will be providing links to many of these locations within the... Uh, description and here is an example you know of using the qr commander to generate the qr codes so i had uh basically selected something to have him do it like i love penguins would be a good example we'll do that maybe in the future next i wanted to talk about if you haven't heard this news item that sony has released uh, a robot in Japan. I'm probably going to mispronounce it. Poik. I, again, I'm pretty certain I'm mispronouncing it. Um, there are some online uh, videos from one of the people who was lucky enough to get uh, a Poik. Or, again, I'm mispronouncing. I'm positive. Um, it's okay, though. I'm certain I'll find out how to pronounce this robot's name later. I actually think Poik sounds pretty cute, though. So these, uh, I think this is Happy Rocky. It might be, I think, like, Happy Lucky. I could be wrong on the, the username pronunciation um, for the hiragana. So I was going to show some very short bits from that channel, and I will provide a link to the channel. So there's Poik. That was a funny one. And then here's like a... And this uh, user has a Lavat. These are not Lavats. And Ibos, ERS, a thousand Ibo. And there is a private group that is visible though. It does have a visible um, you know, it's, it's visible to anyone who wants to find it. So if you want to join the Facebook group, it's POIQ, um, owners and enthusiasts. So you definitely are welcome to join that. And then the last item of news that I wanted to talk about is Sony Ibo might have some updates happening. So this is a clip from where they were showing a future possible updates to uh, allowing Ibo to do more things. So here we go. 
ってて ２ｃｍ 登れたのでどこまで登れるかはいこちら先ほどのマット５枚重ねて ５ｃｍ ありますこれはどうですかね登れますかねえっすごいいいですね